Let me tell you, nine four fine. Okay, nine four fine. What do you mean to say? Okay, so there are a few subtraction problems that are for using the multiples of 142,857. Also, you can make the sums. For example, the the left hand three digits plus the right hand three digits is equal to the middle hand three digits. For example, there will always be a 999 in the middle of multiples of 7 multiplied by 142,857. Now, let me check. Now, <coughs> now there is a multiple. 342 million 999,000 657 okay now there is one sum you can make okay so there was okay so I take the 342 and then I add the 657 and together they become 999 Yeah, this is what the sums are. Okay, so you get into hard sums like this. But even still, these type of sums are even good for a particular 9. Okay, so 9. Okay, so I Okay, so I've kept this 9 for fine because because it is because we are going to talk about nines and 142,857. So, okay, now let me just tell. Now, let me tell you. Uh, 142 and now 857. This can be done with the main number too. But... But there's some logic used. Although 142,857, that number is not going to just say that. Okay, so, okay, so 142 and that 999. Okay, so that 999, we are going to do that. 142 and 857 okay so what do they say 999 okay so this was one specific term of the numbers it, itself okay so to keep this 9 for fine okay now there should be between 142 and 857 there's some okay so 999 gets to their sum so which means 999 which is the which means which is a multiple okay so let me tell you how can i show you the nines because the nines are very special they can show anything here well instead of 999,999 we took i took 999 itself now suppose instead no okay now suppose I took 999 and now I multiplied it by 343. Then what will this answer become? 342,657. Okay. So there is one chance that even this number can appear. Now, 
Now there can be a possibility that there were three nines between the 342 and the 657. So which means that 999 can solve the problem of this. 342999657. Yeah, this is one property that you have to remember. Okay. Okay. Now, this is very easy. You can find it with the multiples of 999,999. Now, suppose I took another number. Another number that is 418. That is 417582. Now, this is one possibility. Okay. Now we cannot add three nines to that. Now since Ooh. now since we can arrange the digits together, Ooh. we get a proper number. That is 142,857. Now we cannot add three nines in middle. Now the now the now the mirror will become like a four two five yeah yeah i know five okay okay so now if you want to multiply one hundred and forty two thousand eight hundred and fifty seven now by the same number you get is equal to yeah i know it five seven seven one no no not just Okay, five nine seven one four eight two six. Yeah, this is the correct number. Possibility is that. Possibility is that these two numbers. Okay, so nine hundred and ninety nine and one hundred and forty two thousand eight hundred and fifty seven. Their one of the chance is the same. Just take any number and 142,857 will use its digits. Now take, now take 267. Now this will become 266733. Now, now take 267. And this will become three eight yeah, three eight one four two eight one nine. Well there are there are chances that it cannot use the digits. Also let me tell you also let me tell you a few parts of that it can be changed into subsequences and done your answer of 999 okay now 814 plus 128 that's going to be 942 no that's not going to work if you want to take the okay Okay, so now take 38, then 142, and 819. Yeah, now just take the sum of the both of those two numbers. 266 plus 733, then 38 plus 142 plus 819. They both equal 999. See? Also, two parts of this cyclic number also equal 999,999. One last example and I'm going to end the video. Okay, it's 999 times 738. That's going to be 733, 7, no, not 737. Okay, 
seven three seven. Uh, yeah, seven three seven two six two. Okay, now this is going to one two four one one zero five. Okay, one zero five four two four two eight five six six. No, four two eight four six six. I meant to say. Okay, now this is correct. Now just add the two parts and three parts together. So seven thirty seven plus two sixty two, one o five plus four twenty eight plus four sixty six, and they are going to equal nine hundred and ninety nine. Okay. Okay, so was this really success? Okay, so were you successful in doing this thing? So if you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye bye.